Hey everybody, it's Renee Sines. Uh, just want to do a real quick video. Um, now I laid this hatch mold up, well, at least the top of it, uh, quite some time ago uh, before I moved. Uh, and I've been meaning to finish up the, the bottom. So this is the hatch uh, that um, goes on top of the, uh, the fuselage, right where the, uh, to get access to the motor and the, uh, whatever else I've got mid fuselage but um, but uh, yep laid it up a while back uh, but I need to do the bottom part so I've already already finished up the bottom there's the bottom of the plug uh, that I used and you can see the little uh, pieces of aluminum I used to um, uh, key that into the, the fuselage plug but uh, anyway let's see if I can crack it open uh, I've already trimmed it I've already uh, cut my holes for my uh, bolts um, and uh, let's see what we've got I'm just <coughs> loosen these these guys at first some of this off camera zoom out a little bit I figured the bottom would come out pretty, pretty easy. Uh, so there is the bottom. That's the prettiest thing. I'm going to trim all this out. Make that look a little bit nicer. Alright, hard part. Getting this. Let's see if I... Oh, not that lucky. Static. Oh man, chip the plug just a little bit. Where'd that come from? That's okay. I mean, these are real sharp edges, so I'm surprised I only got that little tiny chip. You can't even really hear, you can see it there against the back, the background there. Let's see what we got. There's my hatch. Mm. 
in there. So this, all this white stuff is just PVA clay. Um, but, man, that's nice and smooth too. But, uh, all my panel lines and all my rivets came out, so just want to clean this up and uh, start laying up some hatches. So until then, stay tuned.